I'm holding my shin guard in my hand. Good morning, Hopkinton Middle School, and welcome to HMS Today. I'm your host, Jake Strada. We've got some great stuff for you today, and we will start with Mr. Keller conducting an interview about a very cool new thing going on here. Welcome to Minute with the Principal. I'm joined today by members of Troop 68243, Holly, Ava, and Charlotte. Tell me about Attitude of Gratitude. An Attitude of Gratitude is our Girl Scout Troop 68243's Silver Award project this year. Our goal is to teach the Hawkington community about the physical and emotional benefits of having a grateful heart. We have met with psychologists and members of our school community, such as Mrs. Bimbenek and Mrs. Grady, to discuss gratitude. Our troop has many different ideas on how to use gratitude in HMS. Gratitude helps us in our everyday lives. Showing gratitude helps you feel good about yourself, others, and your environment. It helps you foster a positive attitude and more empathy towards others. If you add a little bit of gratitude into your everyday lives, your brain switches into thinking more positively. Our plan is to put gratitude into action through gratitude journals, letters, and rocks, in hope to try and bring more gratitude to HMS. We will be starting stations at HMS, but we'll keep those details a surprise. We will, you can also see yourself working with different teachers throughout the school year on gratitude projects. We also work with kids at the Hawkington Public Library, and we have a trifle in November set up. Thank you, and we look forward to a great year with gratitude. Charlotte, Ava, and Holly, thank you so much for all of your efforts. I look forward to seeing more gratitude. Thank you. That is really awesome, and we are all uh, wishing you the best. Next up, let's check in with Mr. Rockwood and a brand new Fun Fact Friday. Good morning, and welcome to another edition of Fun Fact Friday. Did you know that on this date in 1941, American author Anne Rice was born? Yes, that Anne Rice, the author of the Vampire Chronicles, in which she sold over 100 million copies. And her protagonist, Lestat, has mesmerized many. Also on this date in history, in 1957, the Soviet Union initiated the space race with the launching of Sputnik, a very small satellite, only 22 inches in diameter, that circled the Earth in an hour and 36 minutes. And just think, we have entrepreneurs like Elon Musk ready to magically transport us to Mars. Well, I just want to leave you with a parting note, that a wizard is never late, nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means to. That's it for today, my friends. Be kind to one another and read a magical book this weekend. Thanks, Mr. Rockwood. And now let's check in with question of the day. Today we're asking, if your house were made of food, what food would you choose? Swedish fish. Chocolate. Lollipops! Don't spaghetti! Definitely be chicken nuggets. Raisins! Licorice. Chocolate bars. I would make my house out of candy. Doritos. Peanut, Peanut butter, butter because it's practical! Eggs. Carrot cake. That's sweet. Now aren't you glad I didn't say bananas? Watermelon. To be honest, I have no idea where that question came from. But okay. Alright, let's roll the birthday school. Happy birthday, everybody. Now, if I have you seen this, remember last week when we had 15 answers? Well, this week we got 20 responses. Wow. Thanks you for playing out of all of the answers. Congratulations to Amy Lou. Give another one. What? 20 answers. Give another water bottle. Okay, okay. Congratulations to C.J. Riggins. In fact, everyone else on the list. See Miss McBride in the main office for a special thank you gift from HKM. Everyone else, this is a picture of somewhere in the school. Have you seen this? Send us an email and tell us where it is. 
and from all the correct responses, we'll pick a winner for a candy-filled water bottle. And that's our show. You can see everything HMS TV on our website, HMS Today, and tell us everything at HMS TV at hillers.org. Thanks for watching. Wait, what's the question? Oh, okay. uh, can we not get that in the show? <laughs> Yeah. Alright, a tour through HMS. Let's say croissant. Oh, and they cut me out last time. No, you're gonna continue then if you want. Redo it, redo it. One more time.